Hello, Rocket fans from all over the world. Uh, here's a small New Year's greeting from Copenhagen Suborbitals. As you can see, I'm just in the middle of a, a small part of our workshop, and on the other side of this wall, the guys are right, right now, as you may be able to hear, working on our next space capsule. And there will be much more about that very, very soon. We will have some some cool updates for you on the work on the uh, on the space uh, capsule. We get a lot of questions about how we can do this, how how we can can have this amateur space project. Uh, and how all the money, uh, how the, where, where the money is coming from. And as you can see, I'm sitting here next to some very, very nice uh, old machines. This is, uh, this is uh, one of our old uh, lathes that are very, very, very nice piece of equipment. It's actually built uh, back in, in 1958. And this machine and all the other machines we have is something that we have got donated from closed down workshops or closed down schools or whatever. And that goes for pretty much everything that we use here at uh, at Copenhagen Suborbitals. We don't have a budget of NASA or ESA, but we try to, to make do with uh, what we have. And I have brought a few examples of, of the stuff that we use. For example, you can see down here we have this this little touch screen. Some of you may have seen something like this before. This is actually one of the kind of, of terminals you would use as a cashier's machine. I think this uh, this little guy has sold his uh, share of uh, burgers or wh wherever somewhere. But this is actually a touch screen with an embedded computer. And we have got a, a bunch of these uh, from some store that shut down. I don't even know which one. And basically, we have converted these into the use as engine controllers. So every time we run an engine test, we have a bunch of these touchscreen computers standing and all our engine control software uh, runs on, on these machines. Also, over here, for example, uh, uh, another small fun example. This is a gas cartridge. This is a cartridge similar to the ones used in uh, cars to release the airbag in case of an accident. This little cartridge is quite cheap. You can buy them, surplus. And incidentally, they are very good at pushing out parachutes. So we use these cartridges to, to release the, uh, the parachutes in the Nexary 2 rocket, for example, that will launch uh, later this year. There will also be a lot more about that uh, very soon. So this is just a very few examples of all the stuff that we do here. And I hope that we can get back to you later with, uh, with some more. But as you know, Copenhagen Suborbitals is crowdfunded. We all work here in our spare time and we really need the help of all you guys out in the world. So please go to our website, www.copsup.com. I'll put the link down here so you can just click on it and consider supporting us. We really, really need your help because we are working for free in our spare time and we need your help to make this project continue and we need your help to be able to produce a lot more videos and stories and pictures about all the stuff we do here at the Copenhagen Suborbital. Thank you for your support, Rocket fans.